ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode here on Pasty Just Game. We're actually checking out one last game for the night today on stream, and it's going to be Forgotten and uh, actually downloadable demo from the Japanese PSN store. But because Forgotten and is a game from the West, or essentially, I think I think it's a European company that actually makes Forgotten and. Um, I can't remember. It doesn't even tell the company's name underneath the demo, which happens sometimes. Um, we'll take a wee look and essentially check the company, and we'll check out the game. I've I've seen this in gameplay previously. I've been looking forward to playing it uh, because it's a kind of actiony platformer with uh, beautifully animated characters in it. It's it's Shantae slash flashback slash another world. Um, Kind of fun jumper around in this, so I'm looking forward to trying it. I've been one, I've been wanting to try this game from the, uh, from the company that made it by via review code. I actually did request one, didn't get one. Uh, obviously, they probably have re inundated with requests for a game as pretty as this. And uh, dude, I'm just glad they've released a demo of it on the PSN in other countries, so I can check it out. We did literally just turned on there, so I can go to make sure that it actually had English in it. So because even though it's a Japanese game or a Japanese copy of the game, it still has the English subtitle or the English language available. Check this out, check it out. Oh, I think you might notice circle to select. That's uh, all most Japanese games. Make sure audio is actually playing okay. Are you working? Yep, you are. The world is just as we expected, exactly as we see. Hey, 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 hey. Okay. They're like the old building. All pleased to. Oh, I, have, I have no memory of and recognition of this, but I'm pretty sure is Anne and her. No, this is not what I thought it was. Piece of history just disappearing. I, I, I'm kind of. I'm kind of in love with how. Simple and reality like the um, game actually is. <laughs> Where does that sock goddamn go? <laughs> Love it. I'm fucking in love. <laughs> Is this the whole story like this? Is it literally platformer levels just intermittently interrupted by a whole animated adventure? Quality wood, sturdy, cast iron legs, very nice. Continue straight ahead, please. I'm loving this. Don't worry, we have lots of your kind here. <laughs> now, let's see. Bit worn, no twin, factory knitted. Hmm. I'd advise you to look for a job right here at the plant. Why don't you go down the stairs? Help us change the realm. Apply for your validation sticker right here. Get a job with meaning. Remember, you're not rotten, just forgotten. I fucking love this! <laughs> I love this world, where all the lost things go. I saw you, Anne. You're not an object. <laughs> a couple of gangsters. Security drone. <laughs> With an eye patch. I've only noticed the eye patch. <laughs> the being a fucking security guard. I love it. Holy shit! Where's actually we're in Midgar? They just blew up the fucking power plant. All right. Espionage. Well, hey there, Anne. Weird thing is, like, it's these 
little animated moments. Actually, I love seeing these because it's it's not. It's like it's like you know like thirteen. It's like thirteen frames. This oh god, it's, this is actually the animated character I'm playing as well. A playable Ghibli movie. Master Bonku and I seems like forever ago. Bonku, Bonk you. Oh shit! Oh man, plan seems to be operational. <laughs> There's a lot. Of, um, the thing is, I, this is actually as normal. I would actually be talking over the dialogue of this. The entire time to kind of keep myself entertained. I'm just checking here. Is it actually? I'm just checking audio to make sure that the desktop stuff it doesn't go over the load. Let's see. I'm just gonna kill that. It's because I want to let the ambient audio from this game play to itself without anything kind of interrupting it from the um, radio channel because I have it set up to separate tiers of audio. But this one's kind of like it's you, know, like you can hear the no no kind of in the background. That actually um, means that it's not playing audio constantly. And if I'm not talking, then the music will actually get a little bit too loud for it. Especially if I'm I'm talking and then there's a gap between. No anima in the pipes. I should activate the reserve reverser. Reverser, right? Okay, where's reverser? It's like sucker anima out of the pipes. On that door. <sighs> Love the little shadowy design too. If I install, if I install this reverser, it can draw anima from the tower's reserve. Install, install. I'm pretty sure you meant. There still be a few emergency cylinders in the basement I can use. All right, so to the basement. Oh no, this is the actual like circuit, is it? Yeah, door to mask. Yeah, can't open it alone. It's a two-person door. Um, and I won't have to... I won't need to do that just yet. God! I joked whenever I... I, I said... It's, um... Flashbacky? But it's one of those things where... It's... It's more... It's more flashback in another world than I actually was even anticipating. Like, I said it. And I'm like, yeah, it's not right. It's, it's kind of probably a bit more of an action platformer. It's not an action platformer! It's fucking... It's... It's a... It's a... It's a broken sword slash Abe's Odyssey anime based goddamn flashback, and I'm loving this idea. Oh god, I'm, sh I'm the thing is, I'm sure if I actually start playing this, if I got into the full game of this, it's one of those things that I could just get to the point where I'd. Alright, so I actually suck it out of these canisters and I can carry it with me. Useful. Useful to have. You don't have to carry a big ass canister up the goddamn hill. <laughs> I like her walk cycle. Uh, I'm sure there, like, there's going to be a whole thing in this. And then you can just transmit it. Excellent. That makes sense. So I don't have to actually physically be in touch with some things. Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> That's all I'm expecting it to be. Are you there, Anne? No, I'm not Bonku, but I'm going to be there in a second. Holy shit, I'll be right with you. <laughs> right. Um, there we go. Master Bunku, are you alright? What's going on? A rebel attack. I suspect they were trying to reach the tower. They have no idea what they are doing, or what is at stake. Reality itself. Let them come. They won't get past me. Spirited as always, but they are probably already gone. 
First, we need to restore power to the areas around the tower. Load the dispensers and reverse the anima flow to draw from the tower's reserves. Of course, Master. Leave it to me. Once that is done, find out what is happening at the workshop. The ether bridge is our number one priority. It's almost finished, Anne. I only have one more segment to install. I'll check on Tiffany at the watchtower and get my wings. I'll call you when I get there. Good. Oh, and Anne. Yes, Master? I... never mind. Stay vigilant. We're going home soon. Oh. Oh, man. So literally we've got like the tail end of the Wizard of Oz kind of shit going on here where like we're going to fly our way back. Okay. That's the picture of Mr. Baku. Master Baku. What the hell? Hey, Freeze! Be careful! Oops. Identify yourself, Forgotling. My name's Dilly, Madam Enforcer. I'm a welder. Yes, that's it. I'm a welder at the workshop. Where's your validation sticker? Uh, it's... oh, it's gone. Uh, I must have lost it. A rebel. I I'm no rebel. I, I swear on the human who forgot me. Tell me what you're doing here. Okay. I have an important message for Master Bonku. What's the message? Oh, yes. Uh, there's been an anima outage at the workshop, and the rebels have sabotaged the primary transfer pump near the central station. Do you think I'm stupid? All this way. Through the watchtower. Past locked gates. Climbed up here. Just to tell me what I can plainly see from my window. Well, when you put it like that... You rebels have no idea what you're doing or what's at stake. Oh, please don't distill me. Hmm. Don't come any closer. I don't have to. Be no choice. <laughs> oh shit! This outcome could have been different. Okay. Um, <laughs> so literally we've got a maybe Undertale-esque kind of like morality choices you can make in this. New memento. The day I distilled a scarf. Can I wear the scarf? Nah, sadly not. Right. That could have all gone differently, but I didn't trust him. Rain. Always rain. Well, but it also looks pretty. <gasps> oh, the credits are starting. Holy shit. <laughs> I fucking love this. for this too. Oh, God damn it. It's fucking it is so unbelievably 
Abe's, it's Abe's Odyssey, Abe's Exodus, and goddamn flashback all in one. I fucking love this. Ah! Oh! Ah, I can't see it. I need to climb back down again. I'll be back here at some point. Huh. Who's out there? The enforcer's on her way, so you better not try anything. Tiffany, it's me. Anne? Oh, the rebels were here. They were at my post too. I can't open the gate. The animal flow is disrupted. I'll load the dispenser and reverse the flow. Wait there. Okay. I literally have to get back up the way I came because I should have just grabbed that on the way. <sighs> Damn it. I'm gonna send you look at that and go like, can I get away with actually doing it? But it was it was probably fine if I was further away, weirdly enough. I need to turn around and climb back up. God damn it! <laughs> I didn't think that, like, the, the awkward kind of slightly jumping controls of, um, oh, I love the animation, look, her, her turnaround and skid is perfect. These didn't think about how old of a game style this is, like, another world and flashback from whenever they were made, and how simple, yet also frustrating I can imagine this being, unbelievably, to create. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, I'm so glad this game exists. It's good to see you're okay. Um, I'm so glad you're here. Give me a situation report. Of course, Madam Enforcer. Follow me. A group of forgotlings arrived from the workshop this morning. I thought they were bringing some gizmo for the Ether Bridge. I didn't realize their validation stickers were forged until after they were already through the front gate. So I activated the emergency shutdown. This little red scarf ran straight through the rear gate before it shut. Good. It was a chaotic situation, and you did the best you could. At least nobody got hurt. Don't beat yourself up about it. Thanks, Anne. I won't let it happen again. I know I can depend on you, too. Oh, he's going to be angry, isn't he? I hope I can still go after this. Nobody's cancelling your ticket across the Ether Bridge. I'll put in a good word for you. The rebels tried to blow up the gate several times. It's a mess outside. I, I love the idea of this, like, essentially all the hidden, ob like, the lost objects that were left behind. Could you imagine bringing back everybody's lost things all at once by just being able to jump between worlds? I'm trying to you lost it? I'll find it. Take a while. I need to get my wings. You want me to bring you the anima wrench? Would you? Thanks, Anne. Uh, right. Well, there's a note up there. I don't know how to get up there. Wait, wait, is this where I need to go? <laughs> I can't get it from here. <laughs> Just run straight into a wall. Why not? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can I get through past there? No, that's a, that is a wall. I thought maybe that I had to pass behind it to get around the other side. Doing like an uh, almost like a 2.5D kind of way. <laughs> the camera can't keep up with her. <laughs> Love it. Master Banku, the watchtower is secure, but one forgotling managed to get through. Don't worry, though. It's already been dealt with. A most disturbing development. How did this happen? Oh, <laughs> definitely let them in. Holy shit, you can throw people under the bus in this. That's a bit fucked. <laughs> Tiffany prevented most of the rebels from entering the tower grounds. That may be, but I wonder whether she should be replaced. I don't think that's... Oh, shit. Master. 
Bunko, you are an asshole. I'm sorry. Uh, that's it. That's it. On. Um, you're changing sides. You're changing sides on. Me and you, we're changing sides. Yes, Master. I'm on my way. Right. Assuming this is where I need to go. Okay. Sliding part puzzles. Not a fan. Oh shit. Pair of Icarus wings. I'm alrighty for that. Holy shit! Oh! oh fuck! <laughs> I did not mean to. I did not mean to survive that. Oh. Propaganda note? No. Holy shit. All right. So I'm assuming I have to actually... It's, um, Tiffany, I was meant to bring a wrench to, was it? How are the repairs coming along? Oh, I forgot the ammo wrench. I think I remember seeing it in the basement. Basement. I figured that was going to be the case. Go downstairs. Wow, you get exhausted. Like that. You get a, you like a burst and then... Oh, fuck me. I don't want to run more than a few, four or five steps. It's the little sway of the dress as she kind of halts herself. It's a, it's, those are good pause frames. I love it. Is there a little bit of Metroidvania in this shit as well? Is there like dungeons that I unlock by getting to certain places? Is it? Is it? Is it? Interesting. Okay. Why, well, hello there. Wait, hang on. You know, for a training dummy, you're looking good. What? Oh, the enforcer made you. She did a great job. <laughs> good at patting yourself on the back there, dear. There we go. That's got a full load. Is there anything else I can do with this? Is there anything I should do? Is it, oh, it's just a test to show you that you could do that. All right, fair enough. So in future, if I have to turn something on from a distance, I have... It'd be good to actually keep a reserve of anima on me. Gotcha. Because I'm sure you'll end up coming back two or three times at different locations. And there ha like, I mean, essentially, if they have a training dummy there, I've got a feeling you'll get some form of a weapon. <laughs> you, you can, you like, it's just the fact that she can start running again. Just doesn't really have the, like, no, oh, I'm, I'm, it's not worth it. Wrench. It'll be ready in a few minutes. I'll oh, be fine. Exactly I Thank you, uh, any progress? You're almost done. Does this wrench remind you of something, Anne? Uh, when Master. Your mother! <laughs> you accidentally dropped it on his foot. <laughs> oh, right. I completely forgot about that. I had chosen to forget about that. Thank you very much, Tiff. I am struggling to open a gate. It's crazy. One day they're having fun, the next the rebels are here. Let's see what You're a traitor of the Rebel Alliance. Hmm, I think that should do it. The gate control should be fixed. Try now. Alright. What's he done? Oh shit! <laughs> 
Oh no. It'll take more than a broken gate to stop me. Oh! Go get those rebels. Will do. Oh shit! <laughs> the fact that I like the fact that you use the bird uh, wings to get yourself like if you bounce, you hit the ground like oh whoa! All right, like to stop myself from landing on my ankles and destroying it. Was there a tidy off animation for climbing up there? Oh man, the little—it's the little things. It's the little things. Forza, what are you doing? I'm trying to fix the pipes. We have no animal at the workshop. Master Bunku is expecting us to shit the last section of the ether bridge today. Oh, all right. I think it won't help. <laughs> Definitely won't help. The reverser at the watchtower is broken. You can't fix the flow from here. Oh, I'll never go home now. I'll never again feel my owner's feet. Oh, man. I'll go hiking or climbing or, or running or... Or swimming, because I'm from Australia. You are? Wonderful. We might actually get to go home. I miss feet most of all. What do you miss most from the human world in Forza? I can tell you. I... Quite a question. Where's Strut? He's at the workshop. He's in one of... I can tell you, but then I have to kill you. Thanks. Now stop kicking those. <laughs> That's all I can do. I joked myself there. <coughs> Excuse me. Don't tell Strut I keep the pipes. Ah, uh, don't worry, weird. Ah! No! <laughs> Damn it. I'm enjoying this way too much. I have to play Forgotten Anne. Um, yeah, guys, if you would like to see more Forgotten Anne here on the channel, I would be delighted to play through the rest of that. Oh, man. I cannot, I, I, I cannot, I, I tried to articulate it while I was actually playing there, why I like this game as much as I do, but it's, it literally, it just, one of, some, of my, some of my earliest PC experiences were actually playing the Amiga and playing Another World. That That's actually, it, that, that was a watershed moment for me with playing video games because everything before that was Amstrads and Mummy Attacks and maybe some Bomb Jack and then Nintendo and you know, Another World was such a huge watershed moment for me whenever it came to video games is that I that, that's whenever I saw I was going like this is a fucking piece of art man and I was actually a kid I was actually I, I saw the beauty and actually like how simple it looked but how much it told with just like a couple of seconds also the fact i had a ginger protagonist so kind of like i was a kid and going like holy shit a redhead so i <laughs> think we continued on with forgotten man but um i think our another world just because of the the fluidity of the animation even though it actually felt slow and it like, unresponsive and you, you got killed because like one bad input fucked you over some of that is still here but it's actually i i've almost got a feeling that it's intentional like that delayed run and turn time you kind of just get a, a you have to equate yourself into it you, you learn that character will always act that way will always do that thing at that time in that way so uh, like prince of persia did and abe's exodus and abe's odyssey and flashback all pulled off that same kind of methodology there have been a few games i've actually played over the last couple of years on playstation um i think in exile was one of them it was a guy crashing the planet that felt very, very flashbacky. Maybe uh, more so than it needed to be because it actually was a, sur a guy landed and survived after a, a ship landed on a hostile planet. We're not talking about NXL, which I've forgotten. And we'll come back to NXL sometime because I did record a video for it and then it went horribly wrong. But um, Forgotten Anne has a gorgeous charm to it, um, a fluidity of motion and movement. The characters. I'm looking at them and, you know, do you know there, there's something about them that reminds me of any OEL manga, any original English language manga, something that actually was definitely made to be a style, but was not made by uh, the, the industry or the artists from that uh, that place. Yeah, if you know what I mean. Not, not like an appropriation kind of sense, but more like a homage or uh, doing it their own way with a little bit of a tweak. It's just the character designs feel like that while still kind of trying to be a Ghibli-esque protagonist, maybe the best way to describe it. Just a, the, the intro to it, walking in the stairs with the credits playing over top. Like that was, that was gorgeous. That was literally, um, 
I'm gonna have to try and get this to turn down every time it does because the music got wonderfully epic there while I was talking and got a little bit too swelly to actually go over the top of. Um, Forgotten Anne is actually, it's, 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 it, it scratches an itch that I didn't know I actually still had, even though I'd seen it and play and I was kind of going like, right, that looks like that to me. I know I want to play it because it looks beautiful. It looks, um, vivid and looks like descriptive and it looks like it's got a, it's a, a world and a story to tell and that opening little bit just with a sock and then the world that we saw normally and the thing being disappeared from it like this is a this is a wizard of oz ask isekai kind of thing and i am so on board for playing more of it uh, i want to thank them uh, for actually putting up the demo because i probably wouldn't I would have always thought i wanted to play this but i never would have if it had not been for demos and it's just it, devs if you can, if you feel like there's a good cutting point or somewhere you could actually do a demo with, do this kind of thing because I love playing them and I will probably go through the full game as soon as I get the opportunity. Um, even if it's not here on the channel, just for my own enjoyment because uh, this would have been a forgotten classic if I hadn't actually got to play this today. So guys, thank you very much for uh, watching Forgotten Anne here on Pastiche of Skin. I hope you've enjoyed it half as much as I have. Um, we'll be doing a lot more stuff here on the channel on a regular basis, but I wanted to actually get... Um, some more stuff out to you to actually check out uh, games and titles I can recommend and my god I'm glad this is like a double thumbs up heartfelt please play this because it's I don't think this is going to be something that you're going to see sitting on the top on the high shelf of your uh, dashboard on any of your consoles or on Steam but uh, it it's, looks like a lot of fun so check it out Steam, PS4, Xbox everywhere you can uh, guys, thank you very much for watching. This has been Passage Your Skin, playing Forgotten Man. If you actually see any boxes popping over the top of my face up on YouTube, that'll be for YouTube. <laughs> YouTube. Uh, that'll be for different videos and different playlists I've done in the past, and a big sticker over the top of my face for subscriptions. Feel free to hit that, and then hit the bell below. And as well, remember, you can always support the channel by clicking the links underneath the videos or going to patreon.com for slash Passage Your Skin. You can see many other things, writings and other stuff that I actually do while working on these kind of things and other projects, and you get to see them there. First. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.